Wisconsin veterans are owed hundreds of thousands of dollars, and some of them may not even know it. NBC 15's Rachel Ballion has more. John, the total amount is more than $700,000 split up between thousands of vets. We caught up with one who was recently surprised to find himself a few hundred dollars richer. If ever you could call someone a military man, Richard Amarillo would be it. Ten years in the Navy, uh, did uh, four years in the Air Force, Air National Guard actually, and uh, I did uh, the remaining time in the Army Reserves. He says he served 30 years total, now retired. He recently opened his mail to find a surprise. Uh, unclaimed money that they were holding and that uh, he sent me the applications and the forms and if I wanted that money I was to fill it out and send two forms of ID. So he checked the list online. It was from uh, USAA that evidently I had sent in a, a money for a premium and then later on canceled the insurance and uh, they never, they sent the check back but evidently for some reason maybe they sent to the wrong address. I never got it. Amarillo got back a little over $450. Nice Christmas gift. <laughs> the thing is, there are around 4,500 vets just like him that have money coming to them from the state's unclaimed property fund. The total is more than $700,000. We managed to give back uh, $76,000. Uh, which is only one-tenth. In an attempt to reach vets with money owed to them, the treasurer's office recently formed a partnership with the Department of Veterans Affairs. You have to understand by nature we get very old information because property people have been hanging on to for five to seven years. And I thought, well, wait a second, the Department of Veterans Affairs probably has really fresh, up-to-date information, so let's go and talk to them. The office is now using the Department of Veterans Affairs database to locate vets and reach out to them about their unclaimed property. Truly recommends checking the list once a year to see if you're on it. You never know, you may end up like Amarillo. Money that people can use, I'm sure, in this day and age with the economy the way it is, you know, it's starting to pick up, but everybody can use a little extra money, especially since it's their own. Now anybody, not just veterans, can have unclaimed property coming back to them. If you'd like to check the list for your name, we've posted their website on our web channel, NBC15.com. Just click on News Links.